we gotta be careful to not become victims of conditioning of things that come from our parents from our from media from uh, movies from society from our teachers dump traditions that are completely out of reality in the 21st century hey guys this is mike sigal at truthfear.com and let's talk about conditioning and projections i think it's really important to understand if our choices in our lives are based on our personal choices or some kind of conditioning from society, from our parents, from our friends. And obviously it's probably never one or the other, it's a mix, but if you think about it, let's talk about some examples. You know, a lot of what is happening in India is that you have these arranged marriages. And, um, you know, this is because of tradition. These kind of things were happening there for, I don't know how long, thousands of years or hundreds of years. So it's pretty normal that your parents might choose a partner for you. But I think that creates a lot of issues because when it gets to love, it's you who decides who you're gonna, you know, like, who you're gonna fall in love with, right? It's, it shouldn't be about anyone else. But obviously because of tradition, because of conditioning, because there is a traditional thing repeated from generation to generation, it's so normal that people don't even question it. So these are quite dangerous patterns if you think about it. There is a lot of that happening, especially from our parents, you know. They want to maybe good for you. Maybe they want you to become uh, wealthy and they're gonna think you should become a lawyer but maybe this is not what you want to be doing you, you like art we gotta be careful to not become victims of conditioning of things that come from our parents from our from media from uh, movies from society from our teachers dump traditions that are completely out of reality in the 21st century. And I think especially in this era, this is the time where we have more abilities than ever. We have internet, barriers are disappearing. We have global communication. We, we can access information freely. We can learn anything online these days. So we can become anyone. It's important to do what you want to do in life and not what someone else wants you to do because they think it's going to be better for you. It's important to not fool yourself with these ideas that come from other people and stay strong with what is that you truly desire yourself.